Hey everybody, it's Josh here. I've got a fun, quick little tutorial for you. In this one, I'm gonna show you how to make a non-clickable menu item in WordPress. And what I mean by that is I've got my menu set up here. We're gonna pretend like this services link right here that has a drop down with additional pages. We're gonna pretend like we don't want this actual services menu item to be a link. We want this to basically just be something to hover over that shows us our additional options. I've had this requested numerous times on previous projects and actually uh, we're wrapping up this uh, project here for us, a roller skating rink, and they requested that as well, that they have a lessons and parties tab that has all these options underneath here, but they did not want this to be its own separate page. So you can see here, when I scroll over lessons and parties, it gives us the options to go to those pages, but this is not a link itself. Out of the box, when you do this with WordPress, again, when you add pages and post to the menu, they are gonna be links. So that's what I'm gonna show you how to do. Very easy fix. So we'll go ahead and just dive right into our menus. And I should say, most of you know that I work with Divi. This is not specific to Divi. This is just kind of a, a standard WordPress tutorial. So you'll see my menu structure here that services is a page. So what we wanna do is we wanna take the link right out of there. Unfortunately, if you add a page to the menu, you can't do that. I can't, there's no option for me to make this not a link. So what we need to do is add this item as what's called a custom link. Now here's the trick. If you add a custom link, and we'll just call this services, if you try to add a link with nothing in the URL, watch this, it's not gonna add it but I found a workaround that's really, really handy. And that is to just add anything in the URL field. I'm just gonna put a pound sign. And then we're gonna add this to our menu. So first things first, let's get this in place. And we'll get rid of the page itself. Because again, we don't need that services page. Let's adjust our menu to make sure it looks right. And let's go ahead and save the menu. And let's check it out. Now we're really close. We're not done, but we're really, really close. So now when we go over to services, You'll notice that it shows the drop downs here, but again, it's still a link. Now it doesn't click off to anywhere. You'll see right here that when I click services, it has the pound sign. If we want to make this truly a non-clickable link, what you can do now is go into the menu, go under services, and then just delete everything in the URL field. So again, it's weird. It will not let you add anything to the menu that doesn't have a link, but you can go into the custom link option and get rid of that URL. So now, when I go back out to the site, let's refresh, and you're not seeing an icon there because I don't have the, the CSS class on there, but now when I scroll over services, let's go ahead and refresh here. And now when we scroll over services, you'll notice that even if we click it, it goes nowhere. And you'll see here too, even in the menu in the URL, when I scroll over that, it gives me no option to click. Now, one thing that is interesting is that my mouse typically in this case, like if I go back to the uh, skate site, um, this, if I scroll over this, you see the mouse doesn't change into the hand. It actually goes to the text icon there. Um, I'm not quite sure why it's doing it in this one. I may have something in the CSS that's overwriting the mouse icon, but either way, this is the solution that will work. Again, you essentially just go into the menu, add a custom link. You do need to put something in the URL. Generally, I just do a pound sign, add a custom link, and then you can go in and you can delete the URL field completely. And that will give you a non-clickable menu item in WordPress. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Again, it's not something you're gonna use all the time. Um, there's probably a lot of very valid reasons why you would want to have a services page, for example, that links off. But I have had this requested many times where the, menu, the client's like, hey, we want that menu item to be just like no link. And this is your solution. All right, guys, hope this helps. See you on the next tutorial.